Namaste students Today we will start a new poem called The Squirrel by Mildred Powers Armstrong In the poem The Squirrel the poet describes a squirrel that she observes in her garden On your screen now you can see the picture of a squirrel I'm sure that you must have seen a lot of squirrels in your life at your home and at your gardens They live on trees, hop around the trees and feed on nuts. Pay close attention to its tail. Can you see that it is shaped like a question mark? As you all can see that this poem has only 6 lines and it is a very short and simple poem written by Mildred Bowers Armstrong. Now let us see what she has described. in this particular poem he wore a question mark for tail and overcoat of gray he sat up straight to eat a nut he liked to tease and play and if we ran around his tree he went the other way here the poet is saying that he wore a question mark for tail now who is he here he is the squirrel and the poet is also saying that the squirrel looks like as if he is wearing a question mark because its tail is shaped like a question mark an overcoat of gray why the poet is saying overcoat because of the color of its skin okay that is grayish in color the fur of the squirrel is gray in color and that is why the poet used the term overcoat of gray then he says he set up straight to eat a nut he liked to tease and play now here the poet is saying that the squirrel sits straight and eats a nut as you can see in the picture the squirrel is sitting in a in an upright position and eating a nut okay and this is how a squirrel enjoys eating a nut sitting in that particular position now the poet is also saying that he like to tease and play now as we know squirrels are very funny and a, and a very little uh, creature and the squirrel they like to tease and play make make fun and play around the trees and if he ran around his tree he went the other way now here in the last two lines uh, the poet is saying that if you go near his tree he will go away from there if you go near the squirrel he will run away from you because he is a very lively and a very happy squirrel let us see a quick summary of the poem now The poet describes the squirrel that its tail looks like a question mark because of its bent shape. The squirrel is covered in gray fur, sits in an upright position on a tree branch eating a nut. This is how a squirrel eats a nut sitting in a straight position, in an upright position. Why the poet has described that it is wearing a gray overcoat because of its gray fur. Okay? The happy and lively squirrel loves to play and jump around trees. So if you have seen squirrel near your home, near the garden, then you might notice that the squirrel loves to jump around the trees, play around the trees because of its jolly nature, because of its very lively nature. Whenever the poet ran around his tree, he would run to the other side of the tree. Okay? The poet tells us about the nature of the squirrel that it is innocently naughty and likes to tease everyone who comes near him. Hope that you have understood the poem and liked my video. I'll come soon with another video. Till then, bye-bye.